Hello, good morning, my dear students. This is Thiru sir, your English teacher. So, welcome to the online classes of Sri Eknath Rao Kharse, Thailand English English School, Maktayanagar. So, dear students, we have uh, discussed in the previous chapter that is uh, naming words. So, this chapter we are going to learn pronoun. What do you say? Pronoun. Generally, pronoun is used in place of noun. Pronoun is used in place of noun. According to the personal pronoun, there has been three types. First person, second person, third person. Keep in mind. So these are very, very essential for you. Okay. So just I am writing for you. Uh, first definition I am writing. What is pronoun? What is pronoun? Pronoun is nothing but it is used the word which is used in place of noun or instead of noun is called now understand in place of noun what we are using that is called pronoun okay so a, a personal a pronoun many types it has been many types first point first things we are going to discuss that is personal pronoun the so personal pronoun has been divided into three parts first one is first person first person first person what will come i we keep on mind uh, second second person those who are listening those speaking i we these are the first person those who are listening me bolne wala jo sun rahe sunne wala those who are listening they are called second person that is you you people i am teaching you so i is the first person you are listening and looking that you are the second person you 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 are good my point so you right now third person third point is the third person <laughs> third person means what i am teaching about english grammar so english grammar is the third person i mean it if i say ravindranath tagore he he is a great poet so i am talking with you about ravindranath tagore about ravindranath tagore when i am making to it uh, when i uh, repeatedly i will use so at a time i use he see they are you get my point so they these all the things comes under the third persons just like he or see it the understand what i am saying so these are the pronoun okay i i am 
he see it you can use these words by any names means uh, in place of the names for example if i say for example uh, sima is a good girl so sima place you can write c c is a good girl rajesh is a boy you can use it he rajesh place you can use he so he is a good boy so in this way you can write it rahul is a player you can say he is a player are you get my point what i'm saying in place of name in place of name they are writing he or she or if it's any animal name that we can say it animal or things name when it's animal or things name will come you have to use it if i say what this chalk piece it is a chalk piece watch it is a watch blackboard it is a blackboard laptop it is a laptop mobile phone it is a mobile phone are you getting my point what i'm saying next the same things animal so dog is a dog is a pet animal it is very faithful animal got it so dog place you can use it dog cat any living things you can use it any non living things i mean uh, things is you can use it and for the persons purpose you can use singular purpose you can use he she plural purpose you have to use they you we singular purpose i are you get my point i uh next uh, he she like this got it are you getting my point what i'm saying so these are called pronoun i hope you can understand easily and properly that and uh, you can answer it properly as for my concern right or uh, look at the picture and tell the nouns for each pronoun already name given in this picture name so what we have to do we have to write the name only very easy got it and uh, now this is the pair of words so write this good first of all take the screenshot then after slowly you can write there is no problem but if you won't take any screenshot you cannot write it properly that's it take a screenshot take it good i'm rubbing it now so now the students oh, now we discuss Mm, some pair of words. So, what pair of words? Let us discuss. Uh, hmm. What is? We will learn a pair of words. Pair of words means two words we have to keep in mind. Right? Okay. Suppose I, I place what will come. I with my. I with my. We means us. We means us. You means you are. You means. Here, he means his. He means his. She means her. Uh, next, um, they means they are. They means they are. so my students first 
keep in your mind in your mind not my mind in your mind just give it i my we are you your he his see her they theirs so it will helps to you much to make a to yourself next grammar then after we will discuss um, here also some singular will be here and plural will be here okay so let me see in the pronoun what are the plural singular and what are the plural so just uh, write it down first quickly good thank you next uh, next we are going to discuss um learn the singular and plural form singular and plural form of pronoun Just keep in mind. Uh, how is it possible? If I say uh, singular and plural, okay? Singular means S. Plural means P. Singular. For example, if I say I, I plural form. We. Getting my part. Next. My plural form. I after my will come. Our the same way, the same way. You can also write me. Me, its plural form, us. Next, mine, plural form, us. you are same it is remain same you okay next there is no space this i am writing there you have the space below you can write here otherwise you can write you no problem okay though i don't have place mujhe place nahi wahan pe isliye main idhar likh raha hu main so let you see or oh, that is uh, you are Yours. Next, uh, you are you are you are correct. You are you are. Uh, yours. Yes, both same. Nothing else. Second person. Everything is same. Next, he, she, it. Oh my god. He she it. What is plural form? They. Next. He is her it's what do you say they are t h e i r they are next him her what do you say them the student this is very very essential for you you have to keep in mind that helps to you a lot in your future okay so this table i have written three tables in it so each and everything you have to completely keep in your mind you have to just uh, print in your mind are you getting my point what i'm saying so this also make a screenshot then after you can write properly in your notebook that i can check any cost of time so over next very nice uh, homework given 
and the task many tasks are present so i hope uh, i hope you understand properly and easily and uh, you can write the task uh, what is given for you and uh, so the lesson has completed and this session has also completed so till then keep watching my students uh, later for the next session okay bye